This week we're experimenting with coffee painting. So here I've just got a cup of coffee and a saucer. You just need to pour some of the coffee out onto the saucer so you have it on the bottom rim of your cup. And then I'm just using the cup to create these coffee ring stains all over the sheet of paper. These look really effective if you overlap them, you can add as many as you like. This is sort of a form of doodling as well. You can use different methods and techniques to create marks on your paper. Here I'm using a, a dragging technique. If you wanted to take it one step further and actually use a paintbrush to create marks with the coffee, you can mix and match the different techniques. So here I've got some ring stains and I'm painting a tree emerging from them. This next piece is a really good exercise at practicing painting depth. So if you wanted to paint some trees, for example, you can practice um, painting the lighter trees that are further away and the darker trees that are closer. So you're experimenting with depth and perspective. Also, the more you layer up the coffee, the darker it will get. And you may have to wait for it to dry in between layers. So I hope you enjoy some of the experimentation we've done today. Do try it at home, send in your pictures and we'll see you next week.